Thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring our CES 2018 content. If you want to make an awesome website or online store, you can use their all-in-one platform today. We're here at EVGA not checking out a motherboard or a graphics card or a cooler or anything like that. We're checking out a power supply, the EVGA Supernova 2200P2. And if you can't tell from the name, it's a 2200 watt power supply. That's insane. It has 183.3 amps on the 12 volt rail. But despite all of that, in standard room temperature ambience at full load, a full 2200 watts of full load, it will only sit at 50 degrees Celsius. It is rated on the 80 plus platinum 230 volt European scale. And yeah, European, our wimpy 110 volt North American standards are not gonna apply here. This is way too much power. So they had to move to 220 volt European for this power supply, but that probably won't affect anybody. That'll actually probably be a benefit for most people because this is targeted towards probably miners, considering if you look at the connections on the back, there's nine VGA cables, plugins, and each one of those cables branches off into two PCIe connectors. That's 18 PCIe connectors. You, you, can't, even, you can't even use that normally in a normal computer. So definitely, definitely for the miners. And I don't know what the peripheral cables are. We haven't figured that out yet. We're gonna figure that out probably tomorrow. So I'm gonna to throw to myself in the hotel suite later where I'm gonna break down what kind of crazy rigs you could actually build with this thing and what you'd actually use it for in the real world, what kind of mining setups you might have. So I got really busy and actually had Jake put all this together, so I'm gonna read his notes off here right now. If you threw together a Celeron G3930, an ASRock H110 Pro BTC Plus, which is compatible with 13 graphics cards, 13 GTX 1070 Ti's, uh, some Patriot Signature 4 gigabyte edition RAM, a silicon power 60 gigabyte SSD, or go with the flash drive version, uh, a bunch of risers, a 13 GPU frame, and the EVGA Supernova 2200 watt power supply, you could pull about 6,500 kilohash mining directly to Equihash and ger generate about 65 to $80 a day as of right now and Bitcoin just dipped a little bit. So that might actually go up later on. Pretty insane. I don't have a price for that whole bench because it's gonna change drastically wherever you are and prices right now and all this kind of stuff is like freaking all over the place. So if you deal shop and try to play your cards right, you can make some pretty decent Bitcoin. Whoa, thanks Luke from the future for that super cool rundown. Also, thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. If you wanna make an awesome website or an online store, you can use their all-in-one platform. It'll all be taken care of. They have award-winning templates that will all scale to whatever device you wanna view it on, even crazy new ones that might come out like the iPhone 10, which change how things work and do all that funky stuff. They'll take care of all of that for you. you no know, downloading updates or installing new things. It's all nicely handled. If you do have any problems, however, you can access their 24 seven live chat and email support. If you buy Squarespace for a year, you get a domain thrown in with it. And it's more dynamic than that even. If you wanna post blogs, it will automatically convert to the Apple News format. It's all taken care of and handled for you. So check out squarespace.com LTT and enter LTT in the how did you hear about us section so that you get 10% off your first purchase. Also, thanks for watching this video. Like it if you liked it, dislike it if you disliked it. Get subscribed to see all the rest of our CES content. And uh, I'll see you next time.